Hey guys, welcome back to World Mechanics. In today's video, guys, we'll be working on the E46 here, BMW E46, and we'll show you how to remove or how to replace front door speaker. Two door, four door, the procedure should be about the same. So stay with us, we'll show you on the front right side how to get to the door speaker, how to remove it, how to replace it. As a reminder, guys, we have more than 200 videos on this car, so Please subscribe, many more videos to come and if you need help with anything, drop a comment below, we'll try to make a video for you. Also, just a quick update, we'll have more than 200 videos on that BMW, on E46. So, please guys, subscribe, okay, give a like and let's start on it now. So, all the tools and parts that we use will be listed in the description of the video. Now, the first step will be to remove a cap right here, there is one cap. So we have to be careful which way we remove that thing. Okay. You can see it just pops open like that. There is one screw. Now underneath that airbag cover there is there is another bolt that we'll need to be removing. So with a plastic panel removal tool, there is two two teeth, like this one. You have to push them in. and pull it out. Okay, you can see those are the teeth right there. And we removed it because right here, inside, there is one bolt. So now, we'll be using Torx 20, it's coming out of this set, and we're going to remove, okay, this screw right there. Okay, perfect. One more under the handle. It goes kind of like in an angle. Okay, you can see how the screwdriver is in an angle. So this one was really, really tight. You have to use the correct tools, otherwise you can damage those uh, those screws and it will be really hard to remove them. Okay, once you get this one loose, I don't know if it's going to pop out of there for sure or not. Okay, let's see with the magnetic screwdriver if we can pull it out. Or it's not going to. Okay, we'll get the small pliers. We won't even get the pliers, I think when we pull the panel out it will come out because I couldn't find the pliers. So we'll get a panel removal tool, a fat one, okay, and we'll start prying the clips open now. Once we remove the door panel, I'll, re I'll show you where all the clips are located. And I don't think this panel has ever been removed because it's really, really tight. Okay, one clip fell off. We'll show you how to install them if they come loose. And now right here, another bolt that we missed. Okay, it's the same one, like the one on the other side. It goes in an angle like that. So all together we have four bolts. Okay, now it needs to slide up, I think. We'll check in a second. <laughs> also guys, one more hidden bolt. That's, that's a good thing to watch the video before you do it. So you don't break your stuff and we can break our stuff by showing you where things are. Okay, this one is a little bit hard to see there.
Okay, this is the screw, you can see long screw. Now we have to lift up. Okay, it should go up. Okay, like that. You can see those clips need to come loose. Okay, all those clips need to come this way and then you need to pick it up a little bit. Uh, but mostly it slides this way. Okay, let me show you where all the clips are in a second. But before let's uh, disconnect. Okay, the door handle here and the cables. This is the wire for the speaker there, for the tweeter. This is the speaker wire. Press both in together. Okay, and this one, okay, you just pry this one out and stay with us, we'll show you how to install it later. And now let us show you where all the clips are on the back side. Okay, when we install the panel, you have one, two, three, four, five, six, okay, seven, eight, one's missing there, nine, ten, eleven. Pause on top, you have one, two, three, four, five, six clips. So you can see how many clips. We lost one of them, so we will grab it and install it quick. Okay, let me pick it up. Okay, it went over here under, under the car. So, replacement clips, guys, you can find online. But most of the times they don't break, they just come off. Okay, guys, so with the dog panel out of the way now, uh, you can check out, this is where your main door speaker is located. Those are the tweeters here and the small speaker. So, we'll show you now how to remove it. You need to get a fuel screwdriver. Again, all the tools and parts that we use, guys, will be listed in the description of the video below. So, uh, let me go ahead and get a screwdriver. Okay. A fuel screwdriver, or we can use the automatic screwdriver too. Okay, let me show you how quick it is if you use the automatic one so what we have to do get the bit for it and we just a push of a button comes out no time so all together you have three screws oh, two, two bolts actually one screw my bad two bolts and one screw okay you can check out this is a very fine bolt thread this is a screw thread uh, like that We'll remove that insulation and now you can just pull the speaker out of the out of the door panel just like that. So when you're ready to install a replacement one, all we have to do just uh, install it in reverse order that we took it apart. Now these two are close to each other so they'll go towards the bottom. Probably. Okay. Okay, just like that. And all we have to do is just get them tight. And after that installation of the door panel is in reverse way. Make sure you stay with us and I'm going to go ahead and show you how to install the door handle. Because uh, that door handle cable is a little bit tricky to install. And let's do that. So installing the door panel is pretty simple. But how you install the door handle? That door handle has to be closed all the way. Close it. Now go in on the front side. Okay, didn't go in all the way. More. Okay, like that. Hold the door handle closed, put it together, push in, and you can see it works great. So, so thank you guys for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, give a like, really appreciate the support, and see you guys next time.